I became an artist later in life because of the circumstances. My construction company ceased to exist because of what happened with the 2008 housing crisis. Late in my life, I had no time to waste, so I decided to live my life as an artist. Sometimes you think things are not going the way they're supposed to, but actually they're guiding you in the right direction. As a sculptor, a lot of the art I make is about the people or places I've been and, and just interactions with these individuals that, that really attract me. And I like to see and feel the lines and feel the, the, the deepness of the faces. Well, I've always wanted to go to northern Spain because my heritage, my family comes from there. And it was important for me to visit and close that circle. When I make art, I'm expressing the way that I look at life and the way that I perceive things. I see a connection directly to the olive tree and to my artwork. They're sitting down, they have their legs crossed, and they're just sitting there looking. And it's, to me, it's a human, it's, it's, it's a person. Being Cuban, being Spaniard, being an American. Connecting with my family, with my roots, I feel complete. Sometimes we get stuck. I think once you travel and you go to new, new places, you experience these new cultures, it's just gonna give you a new, refreshed way to look at life. You think you have an idea of where your things are going and once you travel and you go to exotic places, that idea that you had, maybe you'll see it in a different way. Maybe you'll take that idea and say, you know what, I, I was doing this before, but maybe I'm just gonna try this. 